Hello, my name is Anat, and uh, today we're going to do a short preview of a class I did for Eckhart Yoga, leading to the wild thing. The wild thing is one of my favorite postures. It's a huge opener of the chest, and it gives a very, for me, it gives a very intense feeling of experience and adventure and uh, openness towards the world. So we're just going to do a short uh, preview of that. Please come into your downward facing dog. Stretch your buttocks nice and high. You can bend the knees, it's always fine in down dog. Try to get those sit bones really high to get your lower back a little bit more relaxed. And then lift your right leg up into the air and step your right foot at the front of your mat. You can always take a couple of steps if necessary. Then slowly place your hands on the front leg, keep your back leg straight and try to rotate your pelvis to be quite vertical. And then just take your arms up. You don't have to take your arms next to each other, but you really try to stretch everything. Bring your belly back, lift your chest up, as if you want to really lift a heart up into the air. And then bring your hands back down to the floor. Step back into your downward facing dog. Bring your shoulders over your hands, hold into a plank. You can always put your knees on the floor if necessary. Just lower yourself straight down. Shoulders roll back. Inhale, come up a little bit. And then exhale, down a dog. And we do right away the other side. Left leg goes up. Step your foot to the front of your mat. Place your hands on your front leg. Lift your chest up. Rotate your hips and take your arms up. And stretch out. This should feel like really happy, really full of juice. Inhale here. And exhale, bring your hands down. Step back, down a dog. And one more time. Into plank, bend your elbows. Roll your shoulders back, lift up. Down a dog. From here, lift again your right leg up. Step your right foot to the front of your mat. Do one more time. Maybe you can come straight up into your, we, know, we, create, we call it the crescent lunge. Then put your back heel on the floor. Your right arm comes on your right leg and just open again. So you're not trying to go over today. You're trying to go a little bit more back. Keep that knee bent. Inhale, come up. Bring your arm the other direction, so you're stretching out your right side. And from here, you're gonna windmill your right arm and then your left hand down. Your back heel goes up again and you twist to the right. Now, stay here, look into your left shoulder, move it as far back as you can. Don't let it lean forward too much. And start turning your foot to the small toe side of both your feet. And see if you can walk whoop, that right foot on top of the left. <sighs> Lift up. And then come back into your plank, bend your elbows, inhale, bring up, exhale, downward facing down. And then the other side, left leg goes up, inhale, exhale, step your foot forward, lift slowly up, oh, lift, 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 enjoy this. And then back heel down, left arm on your thigh, stretch, open back. And back up, do the other the stretch on the other direction. From here, you're gonna take that right hand next to your foot, spin your feet to the small toe side, and see if you can walk your foot back. Lift up, inhale, both hands down, and bend your elbows. <laughs> inhale, lift. Now come back down onto your bed. That was our warm up, it was short. In the class, we do a little longer warm up. And then from here, bend your right leg and catch your right ankle with your right hand. Keep your left hand under your shoulder. And then push that foot into your leg, to, to your hand, sorry. Push your foot into your hand to lift that right leg and use your left hand to lift your chest up. Take your shoulders away from your ears. Keep your face soft, your eyes soft. Maybe that left arm can even reach forward. And then let it go. Push back into your child pose. Just for a moment, your buttocks come towards your feet. Relax your forehead down. And back into your down dog. We're gonna work the same leg still. So take your left leg up. Step your left foot forward. Bring your right foot next to the left foot. Relax down. 
and then bend your knees a little so your spine can decompress and slowly just roll your spine up. Come into a standing position. Feel your feet nice and powerfully on the floor. Bring your weight into your left foot and the same thing. You're gonna catch the same ankle with your right hand, the left, the right ankle. This time the left hand is right in front of you. And you're gonna try to do exactly the same thing. You're pressing your foot back and you're taking your arm in front of you. Try to find a little balance here, whatever you can. Inhale, stay. Exhale, let it go, hands come down. Take your right leg as high as you can. And then slowly place your foot back and step into downward facing dog. So we are ready to go. Same side, you're gonna take your right leg up, open your hip, reach as far to the left with your toes as you can, and then see if you can drop down towards the floor. Lift your hips up and open up. And really be here, present and open. Inhale, exhale, downward facing down. <sighs> Relax. And come back onto your belly. Let's do the other side. Bend your left knee, catch your left ankle. Right hand under your shoulder. Push your foot into the hand, lift the leg up. Press the hand down, lift the chest. Shoulders away from your ears. You can keep the hand down or you can take it forward. Soften your face and slowly let it go. Give yourself one little stretch here. And really soft and melt, release. And back into your down down. Bring your right leg up. Step your right foot to the front of your mat, your left foot also. And take a moment to relax. Roll yourself slowly up. Take your arms this time. And come to a standing position. Calm and steady. Feel your feet on the floor. And then bring your weight to the right foot. And catch now your left ankle with your left hand. Right hand in front of you. And then start slowly to find your balance here. Can be very small. Just make it a generous offer here. Let it go. Down into the floor, left leg high. Relax your head. And toes go back down. Step back into down dog. And change your left leg goes up. Open your hip, reach far. See if you can drop your toes behind you. And from here, lift up and open. Inhale, send something joyful out into the world for a second. And come back into down dog. Bend your knees and relax. And to child pose. And slowly sit up. And just for a second, close your eyes and feel that openness, that energy moving through you. Feel your heart. Can you actually, for one tiny little second, have this feeling of friendliness in your heart? of true openness. This was the tiniest preview. If you like it and you'd like to take your time to build up slowly, you can click on the link below. Thank you. Namaste. Mm -hmm.